Hello everyone and welcome to Jumper Man Tech where we specialize in HVAC but do everything DIY and in today's video we're going to be going over the Subco Super Boost. Thank you to everyone tuning into Jumper Man Tech. In today's video we're going to be going over the Subco Super Boost, what it is and how to install it. This is the Subco Super Boost model number SPP6, and this is a relay along with a hard stuck capacitor built into one. This is a component that I keep on hand in a truck and comes clutch in certain situations. This is a hard start relay and start capacitor. It gives an additional starting torque up to 500%. So for those compressors that are having trouble to start, this may be your solution. This can be used for all single phase 120 volt to 288 volt units and ranges from units at half horsepower to 10 horsepower. This component comes with only two wires which makes it extremely simple to install. This differs from the 3-in-1 hard start kit that I made a video on previously as that has five wires. If you are interested in the 3-in-1 hard start kit I will leave a link in this video's description and you will see a pop up at any moment. From here on, let's go ahead and I'll show you how to install this. Here on the left is our Super Boost Hard Start Kit, the SPP6. And here would be an existing run capacitor that you would find in your system. Remember, the run capacitors are silver and the start capacitors are black. So, it is as simple as attaching one wire on each terminal of the run capacitor. Leave the existing one in play and that's pretty much it. As far as which wire to put where, there is no polarity here, so you can put either one on either terminal, and you're done. To the left, we have a run capacitor. To the right, we have the Super Boost. The run capacitor in the system, you will keep it in play, so leave it as is. And you simply put one wire on one side, the other wire on the other. Once again, polarity is not an issue in this case, so you can put either one on each terminal. Pretty much, this is what it's going to look like. Either wire on either terminal. If we look closely at the Super Boost, you can see that we have a clip here. And we also have a mounting bracket right here. So just drill a hole through it and secure this properly. Next time you run into a compressor that is having trouble to start, give it a boost. If anyone found this video interesting or helpful, Please drop a like, comment, and subscribe as I come out with new videos every week. And I'll catch you all next time.